This is the only hospital in the Chipembe region. It has 30 beds, 2,000 outpatients, and a staff of six. It's badly in need of some basic repairs. The good news is they've started, thanks to a bequest to the United Church Foundation. Thank you to the United States of Canada for the support that they provided. Indeed, we received that money. And that money was deposited into our account, the institutional account, last month in April. And immediately we received the funds, we started the, uh, the rehabilitations. That money actually has made this institution look the way it looks now. You know, it has been painted, the inside walls, the outside walls have been painted, the, the ceiling board in the corridors were changed, they put new things and they painted, even in the wards they've painted. Uh, they are still working on the painting, with a view that from painting they are moving towards the outside the environment, where they have to improve on the sewerage system, which actually collapsed some three years ago. So the patients were actually using those uh, the toilets you have seen there, which are also collapsing. So we intend to have a septic tank, a soakaway in place, and lay out the sewerage pipe so that at least the, the, the water closets would start working again. Of course, we intend also to use that money to improve on uh, the water, the reticulation. The tank that we have is a very old tank, which is not keeping adequate water because of the leakages. So even that will actually be given a touch from the same funds. Yeah, we also planned that that money should be used to buy the blankets for the patients, which are already bought. Mm -hmm. As you saw, the blankets are already on the beds, and it's something that the, benefit, the patients also are benefiting from. Yeah, we also intended to put up some shelves in the pharmacy so that we avoid keeping some of the uh, drug supplies on the floor or on the pellets so that they can just be shelved. Yeah, even in the dispensary there will be a touch just in putting the shelves just to improve on uh, how to keep our drugs in there. Yeah. For more information on how you can leave a bequest that will make a difference in people's lives, please contact us.